that car's exhaust is now going to be retrofitted into my car. Yeah, I'm not very happy with it. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of season 2 of Project Octavia and this video is going to be kind of like an experiment I'm not sure how it's going to turn out so uh, I don't think that video has come out on Mechanics's YouTube channel yet but they've bought a shop car I'm not going to reveal what it is but just because the part is going to come on to my car you probably already know what it probably must be so that car's exhaust is now going to be retrofitted into my car my car is currently running the vrs245 uh, exhaust system uh, with a performance downpipe of course so it's pretty much silent most of the time when you step on it that's when you can really hear it but still it's not very loud so today we're just going to put on the aftermarket exhaust system that came with that car retrofitted over here it's going to be an axle back conversion and let's see how it sounds So we've just done a quick switcheroo with the lifts. Now we're on the first lift over here in the workshop, and as you can see, this is the exhaust system. I'm running a stainless steel downpipe, and from the downpipe onwards, it's the VRS 245 uh, exhaust system. And as you can see, it has three mufflers in total, so it's a very subdued noise when you're driving it. And the new exhaust system, well, I'm not sure how it's going to sound with it. because the car it came on it definitely didn't sound very nice but have to do something for content kya humne wohi bola sab mere 15000 ki main bola 15000 mein maine becha nahi hai becha free mein jab baba bolega na fir se palti karke to bolunga aap 15000 So this is the exhaust system that we're fitting, and uh, now that the exhaust system is off the car, well, I'm not too sure about it because, as you can see, the finish is, yeah, a little questionable. But I just want to know how the car is going to sound. So we'll be removing the stock VRS 245 exhaust system, as Arslan is doing right now, and uh, let's see how it sounds. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not very convinced now. So the stock BRS 245 uh, exhaust system is now down and as you can see the mufflers that it has are absolutely massive in comparison to the aftermarket one we have a little bit of concern if the fitment of the uh, aftermarket exhaust is going to be correct or not for this car uh, there is a part of me that is hoping it's not so that i can just put on the exhaust uh, stock exhaust back and of course there is a little bit uh, of a hope that it will so that at least i know how it sounds uh with an aftermarket exhaust so let's see what happens if it doesn't fit well i'll go back to the stock one so it seems that we're facing some fitment issues but uh somehow we're managing to put it up onto the original mounting points uh, but yeah i mean this is one of the problems of a not so well made exhaust system the fitment is going to be a little bit of an issue but we're somehow going to make it work and i can already hear my father screaming at me after i've done this mod because yeah <laughs> this is not going to sound too good i have to get a valtronic box for this for sure so while we were having chai somehow these guys have managed to fit the exhaust system and it's still going on once this area clears up a little i just wanted to show you some of the problems with the exhaust 
uh, actually come follow me as you can see yeah look at this i mean there was a hole in the exhaust so they've just welded it together and you know just the whole dimensions and everything is just not fitting properly somehow these guys have though have managed to install it though so let's see how it sounds now <laughs> Yeah, I'm not very happy with it. सब बज रहा है और सब बज रहा है हाँ गलती किया रे गलती किया है ऐसा शिफ्ट्स भी बहुत वियर्ड लग रहे हैं अभी वो सेंसेशन आ रहा है ना शिफ्ट्स का तो पहले एकदम स्मूथ रहने का अभी वो डीएसडी फार्ट का वाइब्रेशन आ रहा है Just uh, cleaned the car, gave it a little wash because it was extremely dirty, as you just saw in the video. And yeah, this video has been a complete and utter fail. Yes, I mean we've put on an exhaust system, but honestly speaking, I'm not really happy with the results. The drone is way too much. The finishing quality of the exhaust system is not very nice. And yeah, overall, it's just not a system that I would really like to run on the car. After some discussion with mechanics, Anirudh, Sushant, and everyone. I think I'm going to revert back to the VRS 245 exhaust system. I'm not even looking to honestly change the exhaust system to something that makes noise because honestly I like the car a little bit silent and it actually helps in making the car make those lovely intake noises and turbocharger noises and I actually enjoy that more nowadays. So I don't think I will be fitting an aftermarket exhaust to the car. I think so. I'm going to keep the VRS 245 exhaust, but I will have to do something about the tips, though. So tips, definitely, I'm going to be doing something because yeah, this does not look really nice. It looks pretty, yeah, it just looks empty over here. So 
let us know in the comments down below what sort of tips I should get. Should they only be tip surrounds or should I actually attach something to the exhaust itself? Uh, ideally, I would want to just keep the tip surrounds, even though some people would call it fake, but I want the car to look as OEM as possible. Um, apart from that, I think so, probably the next video is going to be the servicing of the car and installing some braces to the car. Yeah, even more braces. In season one, during the race prep we did for the Ambiwali drag races, we had put a couple of peak MU underbody braces. So we're going to add a couple of uh, those braces more. Uh, and let's see how the car drives after that. So next episode is probably going to be a service which I will be doing and some more braces done to the car. So yeah, subscribe to the channel to see more Octavia related content and yeah, we're reaching 100,000 subscribers. I think so by the time this video comes out, we will already be over 100,000 subscribers on the channel. So thank you so much and yeah, I'll see you in the next one.